Nobody's saying, oh, crazy. Sorry to keep you waiting. Just sign here, please. Mr. Morgan? Mr. Morgan! Oh, I'm, I'm sorry, Polly. I was just thinking of a friend. Someone who was with me for a long, long time. He must have been a really good friend, then. Otherwise, why else would you remember him at a time like this? Indeed. We used to fight, but he really was a good person. He's gone now, though. Gone away to a place where we can't meet again. I'm sorry to hear that, but if he's a friend of yours, I'm sure he's getting on just fine. Thank you, Polly. You know what? I think so, too. You are going to walk all the way back? Uh. Welcome to Greenway, home of the Red Tweed. Okay, the credits. <coughs> That's the ammunition. It was a very good game, story-wise. Like I said, the action scenes were horrible. Um, take a closer look at the credits. The problem is, since I cannot remember names, even if someone really important is there, someone really famous, I doubt I would recognize them. Director Swery. Oh, the club Swery. <laughs> Funny. Okay. Oh well, um, the problem is this is one of these, the problem with story related games is I only play them once. I, I'm fairly certain that I won't play this game again, like ever, unless I suddenly say oh I have to collect all the secret cards or stuff. But since I'm not that kind of person, I doubt I will. And since I know now how it ends... Ugh. That's the problem if you have bad gameplay. Because if the game was fun, I would say, hey, I'll play it again. Like... I don't know... Fatal Frame, for example, even though I knew the... Um... Even though I knew the story, it was kind of fun to play the second time. Sorry. <clears throat> um. I don't know stuff like, for example, Dungeon Master. I could play all over every time, every day. I could play this game. I don't know why. It's just it kind of fits in my opinion as a very good game. <laughs> Um I I wouldn't be surprised if they would make a second part of this. Uh Deadly Premonition 2. I mean it doesn't really have to do with the Raincoat Killer a lot, but the essence and the style of the game could adapt to another story, another way. 
But if they don't make a set, the problem is if they make a second game, either they they, they kind of have to take something from this game and put it in the second game because otherwise they could call it something else. <laughs> and I don't know, but I kind of liked it. Especially, it's a very it's a budget game. It was released. Uh, even on the release day, it was only 20 bucks. And for 20 bucks, it was a very good game, a very enjoyable game. I, for 20 bucks, I can look over the kind of boring action scenes. And I wouldn't have minded the action scenes that much if uh, I hadn't been let's playing it. Because if I don't have to let's play it, I just breeze through these sections without being like, oh, I hope nobody's bored now. Oh, I have to. I have to do something, I have to be funny or whatever. Anna Graham... Oh! Melissa Hutchinson, Amy Provenzano, Amy Rubinate, Christian Crawford, Rebecca Wing, Doug Boyd, Casey, Jerry, Terrence Zorf, Simon Lunch, Gary S. Martinus, Brian Sommer, Christiane Crawford, Jeff Kramer, Jeff Kramer, Jeff Kramer, Fiona Freckles, George Child, Melissa Hutchinson. Why are there so many female uh, actor who play or who speak kids? Like Bart Simpson was a wom woman. Hmm. Oh well. Um, and I'm sorry, I really don't know what I <laughs> look at the credits. If you could enlighten me, I would be very grateful. Well, like I said, all in all, a very enjoyable game. But this game also showed me that I doubt that I will a lot of Xbox games. I'm not sure, I, I don't know why, I have the feeling it... Uh, how do I explain it? I think it's a lot more enjoyable to record in DOSBox. It, it feels more stable, I always have the feeling my Xbox is going to explode or... Or I don't know, like with the controller, suddenly the controller broke and I couldn't record for a week. And stuff like that. And... And then again, there aren't, there aren't that many games on the Xbox where I would say, oh, I really have to let's play this. I wanted to play this game because I watched Spoonie's first part of it. He sadly stopped playing it. And then when I saw it at my grocery store, I thought, hey, I'm going to buy this. I'm going to let's play this. It looked like a really interesting game. Oh yes, I wanted to mention about the uh, revelation. Uh, Destructoid compared this game to Heavy Rain. This game got a 10 out of 10, Heavy Rain only a 7 out of 10. And I have to say, story-wise, this game a lot better. I never expected George to be the killer. I kind of expected Casey, yes. <laughs> I was thinking, how would they do this with the raincoat killer being kind of slim and case and being this huge? But oh well, FK in the coffee. <laughs> but still, um, the revelation of the origami killer, in my opinion, was very badly done. Not to mention, according to the story, he kind of couldn't have done something he did. I don't want to spoil Heavy Rain for anyone. If you know the game, you want to discuss this, discuss this with me, then feel free to send me a private message. Thank you for playing. Aww. Project Deadly Premonition. A very well made project. It could... It could have some improvement. For 60 Euro, I would have been pissed. For 60 Euro, it wouldn't have been... I would have expected more gameplay, more fun of it. This game was fun, but only 
in my opinion, only because of the cutscenes. The end. Well, something else happening. I don't want to cat fish. Mmm, hot dogs. Hot dogs with tomatoes? You have horrible finger. Yep, he's taking her out to the diner, like he said. <laughs> she has a really ugly model. I don't know. This is this is looking good. Well, everybody who died is here. Thankfully not Casey. <laughs> Hi Thomas. <laughs> Something else is happening. Loading. Well, that's it. I can now start from the middle. Best list. Please wait. I slept 78 hours. Hey. Hmm. Observing time C C C B B A What? Better second is Oh I have an S rank Awesome Kinda of awesome <laughs> five five thousand one headshots twenty of one hundred Hey twenty of one hundred That's not bad That's really not bad Oh I <laughs> never played that. <laughs> the time in Greenvale. Ooh, 18 of 100. Pretty good in time wise. Considering I did a let's play of it. <laughs> I never halted my quest. <laughs> Good. Ah. I only once checked the weather. Good. Hmm. How do I get this? I always went to Polly. Hmm. S. <laughs> oh, I'm 85. Considering I didn't go for any points or something. What's in the special thing? Ah, photos. Okay. Oh, Greenville does exist. Interesting. I kinda hate this analog controller. Hmm. That's cute. Kind of. Nature. Cooking. Mmm. <laughs> ah. Oh. Tasty. What do you guys eat? Mmm. Donuts. Coffee. Bonus. <laughs> Moosehead. <laughs> 